Moving on to other matters, Unsa Kazan of Academic Staff Union of Universities have appealed to President Bola Tinubu to take a cursory look at the plight of Nigerian public universities and its workers with a view to find a lasting solution to it. The Unsa coordinator of ASO, Comrade Raphael Amokaha, made the appeal in Makadi that university's lecturers can no longer breathe as they are being suffocated by withholding its eight-month salaries and end academic allowances. They appealed for the review of the 2009 draft agreement. The Zonal also called for their complete payment and adequate funding of public universities as well as disengagement from IPPIS, whether new or old just as they declare implicit confidence in the national leadership of ASO. While they described as unacceptable situations where universities have been turned into business centers, they kicked against proliferation of more private universities, saying it further drops the quality in education. ASO and Suka maintain that the review of varsity's curriculum can only be done by the University Senate and not Nigeria University Commission, NUC just as the questioned the interference of National Assembly into that fund. Each university law stipulates that the council as the employer pays, the one government as the proprietor deposits money, the councils through the boss fees will pay. And that's why we said IPPS is a breach of university law. So it is the Senate of universities that reviews curriculum, approves reviews curriculum, and not the NGC. NC provides the basics, and then we ask to that. But right now, uh, the consultant went and brought CC mass, which they are forcing down the throat.